When disaster strikes, the most vulnerable often struggle the most. The year 2020 will always be remembered as one of the most challenging times in modern history. The COVID-19 pandemic put low-income families around the world in difficult positions. Some have been unable to provide for their families' most basic needs and put food on the table. Many countries went into lockdown to try to slow the spread of the coronavirus. In the Philippines, the sudden closure of stores and other facilities, as well as the abrupt drop in tourism, caused low-income families to lose their jobs. They struggled to meet their basic needs, which included buying a staple food, rice. This quickly caught the attention of Dr. Samuel Wang, an evangelist in the Southern Asia Pacific region. He coordinated a fundraising project to help those who were most affected. When we learned the situation, we are greatly agitated. We want to thank our God. It is His love that motivated us and inspired us. No matter where we are, we are all together because we are one family in the Lord. Thank the Lord for His great love, and also thank the love of our brothers and sisters. Dr. Wang's team worked hard to give out sacks of rice. During the first distribution, over 1,200 families received rice and Adventist literature. Community members such as tricycle drivers, care group members, and utility personnel came to collect this critical food for their families. The team adhered to recommended social distancing protocols and safety health measures to prevent the spread of the disease. Despite risk to their own health, they believed that God was leading them to care for others. As we know from March 15, the Philippines is locked down and we understand the people in, in uh, everywhere near the capital is uh, having a difficult time. And especially in Silan over here, the tricycle drivers, their business is all shut down. And they don't even have any rice and food at home. So we heard, uh, we understand the situation and uh, we try to raise some funds to help them. So finally, uh, within 11 hours, we have the money we need to supply for uh, 2,000 families over here. For each family, we would provide 10 kilo, uh, kg uh, rice. So that will help them to go through the difficult time until the lockdown is over. Care group leaders at the Southern Asia Pacific Division headquarters submitted the names of families they knew who potentially needed food assistance underprivileged families living in shanties and makeshift houses in six different locations in Silong were some of the recipients of the rice donations. The second batch of rice distribution was organized four days later for nearly 900 families. 400 sacks of rice were given out in total. Adventist literature was included because the team wanted to minister to the people's spiritual needs too. So our members in different places take the opportunity. This is the right time that we can really minister to people in their needs. And this, we are just following steps of Jesus Christ, that he spent his time for the poor, healing them, uh, helping them in their difficulties. So this is what Seven Day Adventist is all about. As a tricycle driver, receiving this 10 kilograms of rice is something really special to us. I am thankful. I am overwhelmed to receive this gift from the Seventh-day Adventist Church.